Hello and welcome to our product challenge. Today we're going to take the Z-Ion by Visible Dust and compare it to the Firefly by NRD. Both of these claim to be anti-static blowers. Uh, and also while we're at it, we'll go ahead and throw in the Giotto's rocket blower and the KOH Jet Air. And um, so what we'll do is try to find out you know, which ones will sit and remove the static charge from our little test bowl here. For our comparison, we're going to use a Chef Boyardee personal meal size bowl that is covered with cellophane and a rubber band around the cellophane to hold it on good and tight. And inside of it, we've got some polystyrene pellets. These are micro size. Um, we'll create a static charge on the plastic, which will make all the pellets attached to it. And we try to use the blower to de-energize the plastic and make all the pellets drop. So I'm just go rub it against my arm. Okay. Now we've got all these pellets across the top. We use a Giotto's rocket blower. We can make them dance around. We can make some fall off because of the vibration. But as you can see, they're not all gone. So again, let's go ahead and re-energize it. This time we'll just try it with the KOH jet air blower. Again, we can make them dance and some of them fall. As you can see, they're not all gone. Okay, let's go ahead and rub it against the arm again. Now we'll try the Z-Ion. And this is uh, claimed to be a anti-static blower. So all these should be falling. Well, looks just like the uh, Giottos and the KOH Jet Air blower in that it makes them dance. But they're still there. Okay, now go ahead and rub it against the arm again. Face it down. And now we'll use the Firefly, which is an anti-static blower. And you notice the big difference is that these are actually falling and staying down where the other blowers just bounced them around a little bit. So, sorry, uh, Z-Ion, uh, you're not meeting the standards of um, anti-static, uh, nor did you do any better than the Giotto's Rocket or the KOH Jet Air. The only true anti-static blower to come out of this test is the Firefly. Okay, let's do one more test here. Another thing we found out with doing all this testing is that when you squeeze the Z-Ion with dry hands, my hands are kind of moist so it won't be as good right now, but with good dry hands, your skin against the silicone creates a static charge on the silicone. So just holding the silicone blower over the pellets, you can see the pellets are actually coming up and attaching to the plastic. This charge is a problem because we've measured it to be at 14,000 volts. And you get that type of voltage near the contacts that most cameras have for talking to their lenses and that being induced into there could damage your camera. So I'm not sure that we should even be using silicone blowers at all. So what have we learned today in this video? There really is only one anti-static blower. This is the NRD Firefly, available directly from NRD's website or at Arama. Thank you for watching and have a nice day. And remember, the best photography is always dust-free photography.